Good afternoon, YouTube. Okay, so we're going to do about a week update after the nipple piercings. They stopped hurting. They feel fine now. Um, after, after about the third day, they did bleed a little bit. So if you get them done, just don't worry about the bleeding. It happens. Uh, I wore like a padded bra so that it, it would, they were like held in place more so. And I did find that helped as opposed to just wearing a regular bra. They, they bled a little bit more. But once they scab, you'll see, like, little crusties. Uh, don't pick them off. Oh, God, don't pick them off. <laughs> uh, once you see the little crusties, um, you're, you're good to go. They probably won't bleed much more. Um, yeah. So, as of yet, I haven't got any pus or anything, which is nice, because you don't want pus coming out of your nipple. Although it is... Sorry, this is just turning in. There you go. Although it is supposed to happen. Uh, so, if it does, I won't get worried or anything but yeah they stopped hurting um swelling's gone down and realistically last week when I said it hurt like a bitch it does hurt a little bit but n nothing I would say anybody couldn't handle so if you're thinking about getting them done then you're watching this video because you're uncertain about getting your nipples pierced well I'm going to advise you to get them done just go ahead and do it because they look really, really cool. They'll, they'll be a really big confidence boost. You won't regret getting them done. And other than that, if you have any questions or comments for me about getting your nipples pierced, uh, that isn't answered in this video, part two, or the first one, then leave, uh, leave a comment and let me know, and I'll be more than happy to answer it for you. Um, yeah, overall, it's fine. They're healing now. There's just there's a little piece of gauze. This is what I'm doing. I use band-aids and I found that what that wasn't enough protection against like just bumps and stuff. Especially it's there's a huge concert this week in Ottawa and everyone's going like it's a, it's 10 days loose fest. It's 10 days long so you're getting bumped and everything. Everyone's bumping into each other. So I took a piece of gauze and just some surgical tape and covered it which allows A for it to breathe. You want it to breathe. It's not going to dry it out also. It's going to help it's going to facilitate healing, like it's going to optimize your healing. That's, that's what I found anyways. Better than a band-aid because the band-aid stuck and it didn't allow my piercings to breathe, which I find that it is necessary for them to breathe. And also the skin around your nipple, it it, uh, got, it dried it out essentially, dried it out and it, uh, it wasn't like it was irritating it. I got a little bit of a rash because of the band-aid. So I've just been using surgical tape and gauze and it's been working out much much better so yeah and that's all i have for you guys today hope you enjoyed see ya